the future is surpassing people's imagination. Already today, we can talk about commercial space travel, colonies on other planets, and other developments that are gradually changing us. However, these events have rarely focused on the transport factor. Although many brands have tried to improve the manufacturing of their four- and two-wheeled vehicles, few have decided to implement maximum technological intelligence in cars, thus turning them into real robots. What can we expect from such a decision? Are we perhaps looking at the first models that will begin to operate almost entirely through voice commands? While this technology has been used to enable cars to perform one movement or another without the need for human intervention, there is still no vehicle that operates more than 90% using this function. Or at least, it didn't exist until the company Baidu started making such a car. Are you ready to get in and try this car? Let's learn more about it! A few months ago, one of the subsidiaries of the company Baidu, co-founded by the Geely Group, presented to its users a car proposal that left everyone present speechless. When it was announced that this brand was counting on planes to create a vehicle that would revolutionize travel, many thought that it was just using a model with some additions that we already know, such as the parking assistant, the computer that warns when a person is colliding with another car, and other things. What did we get? The concept car is, of course, the first electric model with the necessary innovations to be considered a robot car. With level 4 autonomous driving capability, the company is off to a good start in its quest to enter the world of electric cars. Its best bet so far is precisely the Jidu Robo 01 concept car, a robot vehicle resulting from a proposed collaboration with car manufacturer Geely. The company wanted the concept car to steal all the attention of the press and customers, so on the day of its unveiling, they decided to hold a web conference. Of course, this was unlike anything seen before. Through the metaverse-themed Jirong app, Baidu presented the car and revealed its improvements and advantages over the competition. With no door handles and almost complete voice recognition control, it didn't take long for people to realize that this was something they hadn't seen before. However, while these are some of the details that attracted the most attention, there are other additions worth noting. From the information released at the conference, we know that the Jidu Robo 01 will be an all-electric vehicle, as well as having an autonomous driving system, which has been classified as Level 4. For those who don't know, said in terms, we would simply say that the number given in such a classification is the time it would take for a person to be behind the wheel. With a 4, the company has outperformed many competing models, meaning it requires no human intervention. To achieve such a feat, it is known that the car will be powered by a series of Qualcomm Snapdragon 8295 processors. Moreover, thanks to these components, users will also be able to control it, even in offline mode. Quote, Jidu's Robocar aims to meet the needs of smart travel and smart cab users in the new era. That was the statement of Zhou Xia Yiping, CEO of Jidu. To reinforce his words, COO Luo Gong added in an interview, quote, The ultimate goal is to provide a driverless transportation experience. Jidu's cars will be aimed at users who like cutting-edge technologies. It is interesting how Baidu is looking to prototype its own branded vehicles. So far, voice technology has been used to control various household appliances or computers, so I'm sure many people will find it a bit strange to have to talk to their cars most of the time. What do you think of the Chinese company's aircraft so far? Let's see more about the prototype car. To do everything its makers promise, the Robo-01 will also be equipped with a system composed of two LiDARs. This means that an obstacle detection mechanism will be implemented, which will use pulsed laser lights instead of relying on classic radio waves. Along with that addition, 12 cameras will be added throughout the body of the vehicle. After several months of deliberation, it has been concluded that these cars will be manufactured in Hangzhou Bay, in the eastern Chinese city of Ningbo. As you know, Geely has several plants in that area, so it is not surprising that they decided to move all assembly to that location. Now, as for Jidu's plans for the car, production of the Robo-01 is expected to begin in 2023, in order to start rolling out the vehicle line as soon as possible. According to sources, the final model will be 90% similar to the concept car seen at the unveiling. 
As for the estimated price tag given for Jito's first model, the cost is expected to be in excess of 200,000 yuan, which would leave us with a total of $30,000 per vehicle. This has been confirmed by Baidu CEO Robin Lee. While Baidu's model has a whole host of add-ons that make it very attractive to customers, we cannot overlook the clear competition that surrounds this engineering marvel. On the one hand, we have Tesla, which has already charted a long and very solid path in terms of electric cars and the technology implemented in them. Among its models, we find several that also feature autonomous driving systems, as well as sensors to prevent future accidents. Apple and Sony have also set their sights on the sector and have started to get involved. Even the smartphone brand Xiaomi Corp and one of the transport giants Didi Global are making inroads into the global car market. Yes, Baidu's competition is strong and in some cases they already have plenty of experience. However, when you consider that the company was able to hire former Cadillac designer Frank Wu as chief designer and Wang Weibao, a former member of Apple Inc.'s electric vehicle initiative, as head of smart driving, it's safe to say they are on their way. It might even give us more than one surprise in the coming months. And here comes today's video. Although we have already seen that Baidu's robot car will feature a whole series of improvements and upgrades as a result of the technology inside, we cannot fail to mention autonomous driving and voice control as some of the advances that are sure to revolutionize the automotive industry. Now that we know more about the ideas of this Chinese company, we ask you, would you be willing to drive such a car, or do you prefer the classic versions of the cars? Share your thoughts with the community, and be sure to post suggestions for future videos. Thank you very much for your stay, your likes, and for subscribing to the channel. See you next time.